All right, good day everyone. So today we'll be doing some maintenance of uh, main transformer, just normal maintenance, cleaning, inspection, because we will be changing it over during the dry dock when we came on dry dock again. So the uh, today the actual uh, uh, transformer in service is uh, number one transformer. So this is our uh, feeder panel uh, disconnected with the transformer. We have here the number one main transformer of the vessel, the ships. So it's already on and it's locked. The other one is locked. So we will be using number two when we came uh, when we go to dry dock because we, uh, after the before the shore power kick in we will transfer the the service of the main transformer so before that we have to make uh, sure that the main transformer standby is ready and we have to check it and clean and inspect so we have idea what's uh, the 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 situation of this main transformer okay so i will be with my electrician who will be working with the cleaning inspection of the main transformers on standby uh, not on use and uh, before that it's important uh, this is my electrician say hi all right so before that uh, important thing to do it's really important thing to do to have the necessary documents before we do some some jobs in electrical uh, electrical system so first we have to make the it's really important to, that we have to make the risk assessment so the risk assessment is very important if you're doing some uh, critical jobs on electrical system. So it's requirement by the shipping management or any management system on board that you have to check and uh, make a risk assessment when you do some critical jobs or dangerous jobs. Next thing to do is uh, have the work permit. Okay, so we have the normal work permit already done. So this is our normal work permit as you can see. Uh, we have the work permit on my hand so you cannot do any jobs without the work permit especially with this kind of jobs okay so we have the work permits and next we have to have the electrical work permit so again we have three documents that, uh, before we proceed to to our job we have to comply with the requirements that we have to have this kind of document so that uh, we will see and uh, make a checklist that before we touch this electrical system we are safe okay so now we will uh, go on and check the main transformer all right so this is the three documents that we have okay so this is the main transformer the breaker we will go to the main transformer all right it's uh, actually on the inside all right so this is our main transformer we have the number one transformer that was uh, already in service and this is the number two transformer that uh, we're going to be in service during when we came on uh, shipyard or in dry dock uh, we still have a schedule we'll wait for our schedule so what we're going to do is just inspect and clean the dust because there's so many dust here in this area in this area of the world so we'll do some checking and cleaning and then inspection after that after we're done, we'll check the bus bar on the back of the the main switch board so that uh, it will be ready to use during the chase over on shipyard. All right, so let's see. Let's uh, see Mr. <laughs> For safety, is trying to put tape on any metal object on the cleaning uh, <coughs> cleaning brush that we're going to use because uh, we're just only checking the situation and also the what's uh be look like inside so the brass have metal so it's important to put tape on for safety and also this one okay so we're trying to be safe always try to be safe when working in a in a very dangerous scenario this is a uh, 440 volts so especially if you work in a in other vessel they have 6600 volts that was very dangerous uh, i experienced that i experienced that with my uh, electrician before he was uh, caught static oh, see he was uh, so afraid uh, what happened because of the static electricity uh, all right so we have to be very careful to to take out everything that metal 
maybe it will fall in the transformer and then uh, we don't <laughs> uh, want to do that all right all right so see this main transformer is uh good the varnish is still there but the problem is uh still dusty and we have some burn site man what the huh yeah it's standby but uh, it should be why this was burned picture picture you have to take picture so we can report to the office uh maybe they will not uh, allow us to <laughs> change over uh -huh. so during checking we see the one line main line right yes. the main line are uh, a1, B1, the C1, the C1 line, the, are burned, which is very dangerous. So we have to communicate this to the office. We have to communicate this one to the our management to make a look on this. Okay. Maybe they will operate now to change it over. <laughs> during 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 shipyard uh, they have to make maintenance for this because we don't know yet this is the sign already right yes, sir. this is this is a sign that there's something wrong with the transformer maybe before it's already happened that, that's why they changed over to number one but we have to make sure that this is okay so we the, our electrician here john is uh, doing uh, the checking they, there's no bolt voltage here maybe some loose voltage will be electrocuted <laughs> so this is the <laughs> testing <laughs> oh that's the actual test huh? Huh? bare hand touching the main electrical wiring so as you can see it's really dusty because uh, we are in the desert the dust is really accumulated especially down as you can see so this is our main transformer number two okay as uh stated there all right so this is just a simple job of a seafarers we do some checking we'll do some inspection we'll do everything so so that uh before it to be this uh, transformer to be used we know exactly what's the status so if we didn't check like this if we didn't check it and just change it over and we found out that this a problem like this so this is sign already that uh, there's something wrong which was a long time ago already <laughs> it's burned on this area maybe some loose wire or some loose uh, connection here before but now it's tightened but uh, to be sure we have to report this okay we will uh, report this to the office and beside uh, maybe the other line there is burned the one that coming down but okay or they better uh, the we we, oh, we order to change this uh <coughs> what do you call this this special uh, ceramic uh, plate right yes sir. this is ceramic plate so non-conductive non material all right so so we'll do the we'll do just do the normal uh, normal cleaning and vacuum okay so we will vacuum it take that so as you can see maybe there is a history of this one that has been burned a long time ago we didn't know but uh, the extent of damage are inside uh, it's difficult to assess with uh, this situation so maybe the wiring integrity is not uh, the same as 100% before because of the you can see the design that is so uh, that, that was burned a long time ago oh, see it's, it's good that uh, we check this before uh, before we put it in service so we will now uh, communicate it to the management top management so then it's after communicating to top management we will be see what the response if they'll be checked by the shipyard personnel or we'll just be checking it by ourselves because the integrity inside is a very need to be checked but uh, if the bosses said uh, they vouch that it's already been done last time in Rydak so it's okay, we, we, we can just check what we can do. 
here in this transformer so the vacuum uh, pipe that we use is a uh, plastic it's plastic so for better and uh, for safety for us uh, we just uh, take some dust Just do the normal routine maintenance and checking inspection of this transformer. So later, it's just a few minutes, uh, it will be done. Alright. Alright, so the transformer is already clean and checked, inspected. So it's really important that if you're going to use the transformer, especially the standby transformer, to check it, inspect. So now uh, you can see, if we didn't check, we will not see, we didn't see the actual situation now uh, that uh, we have some uh, problem before that was also checked but uh, we have to confirm it to the office to the management so it's important that every time you every time that you put uh, a transformer on standby to service you have to be sure the integrity the the status of this transformer so as you can see we found something good so we have just uh, finished and concluded our inspection and checking and cleaning of the transformer now we'll go to we'll just cover it up and bring back to put it back again on uh, normal uh, on this normal standby position the back of the main switchboard for the transformer we will just check also the the integrity and the status of the bus bar because of what we found on the other trans on the transformer so we just uh, check here visually can you have some light sir so, right so so the transformer number two on service uh, number one on service number two is not so here this is the number two this is the so you can we can check you can check we can check so we can check on the bus bar the this uh if there is some burn the sticker of red yellow and green should be burned so so far we didn't see anything that uh, says that the transformer or the breaker from the transformer sorry is uh also burned the line from the transformer so this is the bus bar that going to now to 20 from the upper part is 440 then already transferred all right so huh. everything is good so this is a uh, safety for the main switchboard they have plastic good 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 so everything is good so only on the transformer all right, so once again, thank you very much for watching. Uh, this is uh, Joel Sibulo, Life of a Seafarers. Please uh, don't forget to subscribe and watch our channel. You will uh, learn more and uh, more I will bring more educational videos for, for you guys so that will uh, grow our channel. Thank you very much. Cheers and good day, everyone.